structural forces and loads. Dead load, live load, and lateral load is weight, use, and wind. By focusing on the various loads or forces placed on structures, we can better design for their impact. The main force on a structure is the weight of the structure itself, called the dead load. The use of the structure, like people or furniture or snow, is called the live load. Wind blows against the side of the structure, creating a sideways pressure or lateral load. Structural engineering will use load factors to increase the loads predicted on a structure to a safe level of design. The difference between the actual loads and the load and the design loads, which are predicted loads multiplied by the load factors, is the factor of safety involved in the design. Load factors are based on historical analysis of loads experienced by structures. Loads in combination can cause problems to be compensated for. For example, if a lateral load can sway a structure enough to move the dead load off the carrying capacity of the columns, called eccentricity, and produces a moment load, then the dead load can cause the structure to fail. The main structural forces acting on a structure are dead load, the weight of the structure, live load, the use of the structure, and lateral loads, sideways forces. Multiple choice questions, structural forces and loads, A. Dead load, live load, and lateral load is weight, use, and wind. B. Roof rafters attached to ridge with ceiling joists and blocking. C. Joists move load horizontally. Columns resist load vertically. D. Earthquake load can be sideways or acceleration up. Well, the best answer choice from what we've been given for structural forces and loads is A, dead load, live load, and lateral load is weight, use, and wind.